Hello and welcome, this is Rather Dean This and today I'd rather be playing Divinity Original Sin 2 with Ricky, our Wayfarer. Last time we finished the tutorial and met all the characters in our main hold here that seem to have origin stories. I think it's all of them. And time for us to continue. Um, not through that door, it seems to be locked. Um, Maybe there's a door on that side, so let's try that. Kill our own. They're picking us off one by one. Can we just skip to the part where I reassure you? It's a register, sir. Good, good. Magister Williams is just about done with the last passenger. Okay, great. Hearing okay so far. Um, ask him if he'd be fine. Collared like a dog and stuck in a ship's hold with a corpse and a murderer on the loose. Say you've been through this. Yeah, let's go. Trust me, with Bishop Alexander in charge, things will get a lot better from here on out. He's god walking, you know. Oh, really? I'm sure he is. Um, we can trade with him. He's got a sheet of paper. No, nothing really. I'll come back. You better be ready. Um, we can maybe s sell these pens. Um, I've seen more appetizing things coming out of plague stricken pigs. Rope. I'm not sure if any of these stuff we're gonna need. Okay, let's just just set him the pants for now. That'll be fine. You head on in now. Williams will get you short at fast. Okay. Uh, there has been a murder, Your Majesty. Maybe that has the Standing at the centre of the room, you spot a sorcerer haughtily eyeing a pair of nervous-looking magisters. They keep their crossbow trained upon her as she's being interrogated by an officer. You seem to be really threatened by a woman. So you admit in chain. You murdered that poor fella. Oh, she murdered him. Yes, I did. But of course, that was only the beginning. Uh, Windigo. She turns her head and looks you straight in the eye. There are others whose lives must end. Um, is she threatening me? Good God, the woman's mad. You there, sorcerer, go and fetch Magister Siwan. We need to do more than collar this maniac. We need to shackle her hands and feet. Um, say yes, sir, and turn to leave, and the murderer might be dead. This may be the perfect opportunity to create a mutiny. Tell the woman you stand by her. Address the sorcerer and ask, what is she meant by this other little bit? You know, let's find out from her. It means your journey draws to a close. Oh. Do stick around for its finale, though, because... She reaches for her collar and simply removes it. Oh. Um... I'm just about to create a scene. Subdue her, man, quickly! If she casts source, the Void Woken will come. They'll end us all. She smiles with wicked satisfaction. Precisely. Oh. What is an expected source blast? Wow. Okay, well so much for fighting. What what's happened? Chronicle continues the merry with it. Okay, um, so everything's on fire, that's not good, um, oh please tell me we can take, oh, uh, what happened to those crossbows you had? Well, at least we can get the money. Display case, nothing. Uh, Confiscated. Ooh, toy crossbow, wooden pitchfork, improvised wand. Excellent. Um. What do I sort? This does water. All in toy crossbow. I feel toy crossbow is what he needs. Um, that's his proficiency, I believe. Is 
you know, this is all these this stuff all requires errors. Improvised one does water. Although maybe with all this fire around some water would be a good idea. Okay. Okay, let's grab everything that we can. Bottle of wine, empty cup. So the fish is on the fish. I saw fish on there and just sort of talking. Oh, there's a fish, a red snapper. So what I'm saying is the place is on fire and what do I do? I start looting. That sounds pretty usual. That's that's kind of a standard deck of cards. Okay. Playing cards. I don't know why the cards don't show up. Display case. Bottle of wine, all these empty cups. Uh, can you get into the room from this side? Um, can we attack it? 430, oh, okay. I guess not. Let's go through the... Okay, maybe... The... Oh, okay, hang on one second. Let's grab this. Requisition. Pots and coal. Oh, much too hard. Oh. Okay, so tab puts you into. A uh, tab, I suppose, is the same as that unsheath. Flower pot. Okay, let's put the flower pot. Can we like, throw something? Oh, yeah. Oh, that just places it. Ah, oh, magistrate. There's a key. Oh, so all the stuff that we bought it for, we can just kind of take now. Saw sound empty. Register. Nothing. Oh. Is. The young woman lies in a heap on the floor. She's breathing normally, but her eyes are wide open, like those of a corpse. Dark, she doesn't... Wake up. Oh, okay. She's not waking up. The dwarf lies in a heap on the floor. His great beard twisted and tanked. You hear a faint thud, thud. Okay, they're alive, but there's not much we can do with them. Oh. Well, that's all the stuff we sold there. Edge to Victor. Okay, can we open this door now? Um, hmm. Could I not just get a key? Did he not have a key? No. No, not the final dark. Not yet. Her hand lies limp in yours. She's took the dice roll darkly. They're rolling for me. Okay. Oh dear. None of these are looking very good. Yeah, all of this trading and now we're just taking all of you. Magister lies on the floor, unconscious and bleeding from a dire looking wound. Oh, she's still a ancient book. 
Okay, well, we can take it, seems like she's unconscious. It seems it's in the ancient book. Stolen. Source knights and sisters know magic's two files, even those that would block or even remove the source with an individual. I doubt in his madness. It is an invitation to manipulate all which is once believed immutable. He provides all manner of experimental subjects. The text beneath lists a series of hexes and materials requiring mutating source. Some of these objects are encircled in black ink and annotated as follows. Helm, collar, mask. I must see the marketers. Oh, gold cup. Shiny. So let's grab the gold cup and that. Here yeah, we've got everything else. Did we go up these stairs? It's blocked. I'll need to find another way. Oh. Okay. I suppose it would have <laughs> some rope. The bucket helm. There was a staircase somewhere else, I presume. Oh, here. Yeah. So I wonder if that key that we just got... ...would fit this side. Locked. Um... Putting that there, which will create oil, and then throwing a candle on it. No. Hmm. Okay. Oh, I thought it would be going on to the, the deck of the ship. No, there's another level. Okay, well, let's carry on exploring. Quick. Well, let's go ex carry on exploring the uh, the burning ship. Wet. Okay. Where's the Sherry? Where's the swordsman with no sword? Carry on looting as we go. Not long before this thing snaps into splinters. Pressing tabs because that's the this box is too heavy. This thing seems to be too heavy. Let's... Okay, well, I remember where it was if I needed it. I thought I would need it with all these flames, but I haven't needed it yet. Oh my God. Something's pounding on my hull. Something's pounding. Is that fame? Ow. Onwards and upwards. It's Ah. Oh, my first bat bow. Um Skull Mod Key. Note. Okay, let's take it all. Read the key note. Death fog barrels have been locked down in storage. Stay out. You and Rick's both. If anyone starts feeling around, there'll be lights out. Um, the toy crossbow is giving a minus one to movement. Scales with finesse, level one. I wonder if it is 5% accuracy as well. 
I don't know whether I should rather go... So if I do that... Movement is 5.1, but it's 67. 7 to 8, but less movement. Mm. Now they were saying movement's important to get high ground and things, but at the moment... Okay, let's just stick with the crossbow for now. Here's Fane. ...through the door and are suddenly face to face with an undead. His skull is bizarrely angular and a glorious jewel sits in the middle of his forehead. The skeleton is quickly leafing through a volume of Cranley Hubert's famous encyclopedia, muttering to him... Now, it is the same guy. What damn fools record knowledge on... It catches fire. It turns into must when wet. It cannot even resist acid. No wonder they're so bloody ignorant. <laughs> the skeleton looks up and notices you for the first time. Oh, it's you. Shouldn't you be... Running and screaming or such here. There's something familiar with the way. I've checked the undead monos. Asking we shouldn't be doing the same. The ship's going down. Groans and looks back to his book, frantically flipping from page to page. I know your god did not gift you with much, but kindly use the little you were given. Do you look at me and think, why, yes, there is someone with organs enough to drown? <sighs> Trifling matters like water and poison do not concern me. No, damp robes are the most I have to fear. Once this glorified skiff hits the sea floor, I will simply walk to shore. Whereas you, I believe, have lifeboats to pointlessly squabble over. <laughs> lifeboats. Ask why I didn't see him before. He kind of stands out. I believe you did. Although I was wearing the face of an elf. He's wearing the face of an elf, oh my word. Mask, rather ingeniously designed, which allowed me to take that... Oh, so it wasn't a spell. He had a physical a mask, mask on. Stolen by that damned witch after her little scene. Still, she'll drown with the rest of these fools. And I will simply pluck my mask from her cold, dead hands. Oh, that seems quite sensible. Indeed. Just as sensible as getting off a sinking ship and leaving a fellow to his business. I would say good day, but it seems quite likely that you're about to die a rather terrible death, so... That's okay. It's casually and rich. <laughs> okay, so he's going to, um... He's not too bothered. Now we've got another Magister here. Another bow. Mm. Oh, there's a wet dog. Let's talk to this one. Desperately it is snout. It winces as it draws blood from its wet black nose and continues scratching. Tell the dog to get out of here, it's going to sink. The dog notices you for the first time and snarls. The hairs on his back prickly. No, no, don't attack me. What for? Oh, you sorcerer! Oh, I'm a sorcerer, right. He sneezes suddenly and paws at its nose once more. Can't I smell. Can't breathe. Too much sauce. Too much... Oh, OK, yes, he's been trained to smell the sauce and with all the sauce magic it's driving you nuts. Socks put him out of misery. You're not the one who did this, you'd stop it if you could. The dog whines and. No. Doesn't believe that much. Okay, so that goes into the main hallway where we came up. Oh, there's some people in here. I think I should be quick saving all the time. That's locked. Um, level 30. Okay, so there's... If I get one of these and put it here, it should catch fire and burn the door. 
Yes, but not for much. Uh, okay. Do you want to just... Okay, well, let's stand outside here and let's just attack the door. What was? He eyes the collar circling your <laughs> Shaky, shaky, shaky. He's always in. Reaches his hand towards his blade. Another sorcerer. Hey, I'll just let you out. His companion doesn't blink, frozen in place at the sight of you. Motion of destruction around you. What's going on here? What have they seen? You can help them if they get the stupid device off you. Draw your weapon and be done with them. Wave your hands in the air and chant some gibberish. They'd better not mess with you. He leaps to attention, then whispers loudly to the other magister. Don't just cower there, Rix. Take out your blade. Rix raises his sword, which shakes to the rhythm of his trembling hand. Is oh no. <laughs> Oh, that's not good. Oh, well, can't you take a joke? Um, okay, so I feel... Oh, okay, okay. So with the short bow, I'd have more range to get further. Right. So I could move back here for two. And there we go. Then, if he had to come through, he'd be burning. He's burning. No, it doesn't make it. He's only got four. Um, we have a pinning shot. Takes three. So if I go back one, four meters to here. We set ourselves some distance and then do a winning shot. What? Okay. Ow. Hey. Hey. Okay. Clearly, I just need to shoot him. How rude. And he's got a bowl with him. Well, he did have this massive big sword as well a few minutes ago. And what else is in here? A chair and a globe. You thought on this flat. Okay. Some books. The sorcerers, hunters, valiant though they were, could not foreseen Bacchus's resurrection at the hands of the cult of the Maculates. We owe our very lives to two more of the very order at the first f that first fought to bring Bacchus Rex to justice. The Source King is dead. Yes, his monument still not dot the land. A chilling but necessary reminder of his le legacy of cruelty, greed, and arrogance. Greed and arrogance. Okay, all the same. I know, Sorcerer Monos once performed great deeds across the lands. In the first days, Barakas did, did so from the isle he called home. But in time, as is true of so many things, he became increasingly corrupted by Source. So great was his greed and his fear that crafted a soul forge with his twin, Cassandra. Once the ritual was complete, Barakas turned her into an undead lich. lich. So she and thus he might live forever. Uh, okay, maybe. Portion of Eve, Volume 7. 
Oh, over many brutal decades, Baraka's tendency spread. His hunger for source and political power drove him to develop genius devices and magic. He have heretofore unknown. He punished the living with death and the dead with undeath. Many attempted to stand up to him, wizards, philosophers, scholars. But it was the order of the source hunters that ultimately forced Baraka's Rex to atone for his sins. Okay, uh, letter, cup of water, oh, nice pillow, shabby letter, let's check through the desk, nothing in the desk, uh, anything else, no, a coal and an ink pot, Knockdown arrow and a wooden torch. Oh, nice. Oh, this helps us heal. Okay. Well, let's heal up a bit. Nice. Can you open this from this side? No, it's locked. Oh. No books in the bookshelf. Oh, we can take the paintings off the walls. This should be worth something. Oh, I suppose we can do... There's another painting. Well, they're not worth anything at the moment. Wooden torch? Oh, it's a shield. Okay. Letter. My sweet Stefan, as I write this letter, we near the aisle. By the time the owl delivers it, it will, I will be but a day away. I've heeded Alexander's orders, just as I said I would, but I think of Lucian often. Would the divine have condoned this? Would he have blessed us as we ripped children from their mothers? Can this be the only way? I feel cold, inside and out. Of one thing I'm certain, your arms will warm me when I find you again. With love, Rix. Oh. Well, sorry, we killed Rix. Mm. Maybe we should not mention that to Stefan when he see him. They seem dumb close. Okay, so that seems up to the next level. This here, skull marked door. This would be the where the deaf fog is. The marking on the door was painted recently, judging from its pungent scent. You don't recognize the symbol, but it's clearly warning you away. You press your palm against the door to open it. The wood feels neither cold nor warm, but simply grey. Open the door. It's from your hand, and you are left numb. It doesn't budge. Use the key. The door groans open, but an ashen shadow clouds your mind. Okay, that's not good. Um, with this... Oh, this barrel here, we haven't... This water barrel will wash away. There's fog. I need to get out of here now. Mm. Okay, so water doesn't do anything. And 
and if we oil and then can we if I can will I be able to loot doesn't have anything Magister Inquisitor It's a part of a sword It's in these barrels Money Useless jug Dead for the death for the living. Now, if we had um, Bane with us, he doesn't seem to. Oh, there's a chest here. Anything else? Oh, there's some bags over there. No, nothing in them. Okay. I feel there's another chest there. How did you miss all of these? Oh my word. Some coins in them. And if they don't highlight when you press Why am I getting turned around? Ah, there's the stairs up. And another drum. And another one here. Nothing in it. Nothing in that. Probably missed the key somewhere. Okay. It's game so that's always a good right oh my word uh, what is that a vicious voidling um and a massive tentacle okay how much of these got 24 24 Within, this is within f forks up to two times within five meters. That's twelve meters there, so that'll be too far. Um, so we could. Cheated twice. Uh, we could move away, but I feel we'd be getting trapped there. Uh, I get trapped in that corner as well. There's no fire close enough to set a one of those balls on thing. Okay, let's try shoot it and cripple it. Okay, excellent. And then move one away. Excellent, now it's poisoned. Um, if I shoot this, it should get both of them. Nice. And this would get 
both of them, right? And they're slowed. Ouch. Ouch. He's still pinned, right? Um, but six I could probably... Dead. Hey, great, got them. Did take some damage though. Fireball scroll. Very nice. Slurred. Ooh. Okay, uh, yeah, I'm not going to go all the way down there for a bucket. Anything else? Oh, I can move around a bit. That's not good. Fire oh, yeah. two turns. Okay, can we? No, we can. Move the, the barrel up slowly. Could we? Can't see. Here we out. Target's too far. Uh, so we go and get this other barrel. Okay. Okay. Now the Okay. Now can we get a stained shirt after all that? Improvised wand and blinding radiance and some gold. Okay, can we steer the ship? No. Okay, well that wasn't particularly useful. Slowed. Except, um, stained shirt, thread. Okay. Okay, that's better. Blinding radiance. Air damage. And a pillow. Feel this is always the jug, the jug, the plates, water and pestle, the core, these pots, these cups. Three big up. Two ones, one f water and one fire. Okay, so the ship's burning has been attacked by a massive monster, and I'm looting. And that sounds about right. Ah, okay. Here's our ship. Are our friends aboard? Uh, I don't see them. Ow! Those things just got destroyed. 
children and dwarfs first, just like the old The children and dwarfs. Oh yeah, Gil, yes. You were talking to Beast at the table below. The dwarf yanks at one of the nearby ropes to no avail. You said there were other people down there. We we need to help them. You see those tentacles, kid? It's time for getting the hell out of here. Yeah. Tell the dwarf a yellow belly coward. There's a ladder right over there. You can go straight down. You're gonna be the death of us, you hear? Okay. Let's get going down this ladder. Okay, will we be able to wake our friends now? Okay, well they're they're standing up now. Ah, fight! Wait, void broken. Okay, well, we seem to have everyone in the fight now. Um, uh, would we, no, we're not going to get both of them with that. Do you think five meters? Okay, let's hope that they're within five meters. Yes, they are. Um, okay, we got one down. Okay, well, Beast has got one. Okay, well, he set that one on fire. Ah, okay, I was worried about that one. It seems to have gone... Backslap, backstab, critical. They who are about to triumph. <laughs> they are about to triumph. Salute you. <laughs> Not to those about to die, like the. Uh, we threw all the way over there when there's one right here. Faced worse. He's going to go encourages everyone and blinding radiance. Adrenaline and backstabs seems to be pretty much in it. Okay, you come to thank me? No, you're running right past me. I hear something, it's... Sounds like she needs help. Oh, okay. Knocked down, oh. Uh, so they got onto the ship and I get left behind. Well, that doesn't seem right. Well, that's a mess of beastie. So I die for saving them? I have plans for you, child. Rise. No. I get saved. Honorable Dallas, we lost a ship sailing sorcerer prisoners to Fort Joy. We assume some escaped and broke their collars. Their vile magic lured the Voidwoken. All who were aboard are presumed dead. Yours faithfully into eternity. High Judge Orivan. Right, and I feel with that you've made it to the next chapter, and I think I'm going to put a cut in there. So I'm going to say this is rather in this, and I'd rather be playing Divinity Original Sin. But I'll see you next time, where we carry on with our story. Bye.